What can you and I do to help protect nature? That question lies at the very heart of this year's UN Biodiversity Conference in Kunming. Here's the gist. When we talk about environmental action, it's the big ticket items that often get the most attention. The oceans, naturally, they do cover more than two thirds of our planet's surface, and rainforests, the lungs of the earth, not forgetting wildlife, with so many species threatened, from jungle elephants to the tiny, hardworking bee. Yet the Convention on Biological Diversity wants to call attention to human activities that are more destructive than they look. Tourism, for example. People make trips to beaches, national parks, and even cities for the natural beauty they offer. With around 1.4 billion tourists each year, there's a lot to consider, including air travel and the footprint left on these destinations. Another is fashion. Every piece of clothing we put on each day adds to the ecological pressure, from production all the way to the end of life. How much are we constantly buying to stay in fashion? What about laundry? And what happens to apparel we discard? Then there's our indispensable friend, technology. Phones, computers, TVs, kitchen appliances. The list of gadgets that make life easier for humans has created a green nightmare. In 2019 alone, the world disposed of a record 53.6 million metric tons of electronic waste. Plus, our demand for infrastructure never stops. Pipes to carry water, the energy grid, roads and industrial farming to produce food. Modern living simply encroaches on the environment. These are things we can't easily give up, yet progress is also setting us back. The UN's message is that more action is needed because preserving biodiversity is not merely a responsibility, it is a necessity to ensure our future. And now, you have the gist.